Metro Detroit gearing up for the solar eclipse. People are coming out in droves, even pitching tents to get the best possible view. 7 Action News reporter Gino Vici is live from the University of Michigan campus in Ann Arbor where they're holding a viewing party. Gino, what's happening there? Well, Simon Brand, you know, these are some pretty dark shades, but the experts warn these are simply not going to cut it. As you mentioned, there is a viewing party here at the Diag tomorrow for the solar eclipse. You know, we spoke to many people on campus here tonight uh, viewing for this party. is The seating is limited, but people we spoke with here tonight say they're excited about watching it anywhere. It's funny having so many weeks, I guess, leading up to it. I definitely want to see it. Uh, I'm hoping it lives up to the expectations. Lots of anticipation for the solar eclipse happening tomorrow here in Michigan, beginning at 1.03 p.m. and ending at 3.47 p.m., with the solar event being most visible at roughly 2.27. It's a once-in-a-lifetime event, especially for those born after 1978, the last time a full solar eclipse happened in the U.S. Yeah, I think it's really interesting. It's certainly a cool event, but the experts warn whatever you do, do not look directly at the sun without the proper eye protection. And dark sunglasses aren't going to cut it. Make sure your goggles are approved for this type of viewing of the big event. But for some, they're still not getting all the hype. So it's something I'm buying into too much, but at the same time, seeing that an entire nation is going bananas over this thing is still pretty cool. Hype or no hype, a full solar eclipse could be a once-in-a-lifetime astrological event. Here in Michigan, weather permitting, we'll likely only see a partial eclipse, but there is a 70-mile stretch of the U.S. where the shadow of the moon will completely cover the sun, creating darkness. News of the once-in-a-lifetime event, whether you're a stargazer or not, certainly has some flair. Like you said, a once-in-a-lifetime type event, you can't pass that up if it's possible. Again, to get the full effect, you're going to have to do some driving and head south. But uh, here in Michigan, again, you're going to see a partial eclipse tomorrow. And uh, folks here on the U of M campus and here in Ann Arbor are excited to see this event. So uh, we're live in Ann Arbor, Gino Vici, 7 Action News.